Uh, hi everyone, I'm Stan from Eagle Vision. I'm here with Tim Wood. Tim, welcome. Thanks, Stan. Tim and his wife, Rebecca, they own a furniture store called uh, Bow Concept Adelaide. And uh, look, Tim has had a background in furniture for over 40 years. And I was keen to catch up with Tim and talk about how property developers and project marketers actually utilize furniture in staging projects and apartments and high-end homes and that kind of stuff. So how did your family transfer across to Bow Concept and why did you make that decision? Yep. Uh, well, as you said, we've been in furniture for over 40 years in the luxury end of the market um, and we've always been a very design driven organisation. So customers don't just come in for a couple of pieces of furniture, they come in and want us to guide them through that whole process of making their home beautiful. Um, Bow Concept has been is one of the, the world's best known furniture brands and they we really connected with the fact that they are also very design directed and uh, but they're at that slightly more accessible end of the market so still at the premium level right. but more broadly accessible um, and mm. so okay. yeah that's how it came about fantastic and so how do property developers start to utilize Bo concept into their developments and projects yeah I guess at the initial stages is yep. for staging of their right. properties yep. um, and that's uh, staging well I guess is a, a means of differentiating the developers product from another because yep. especially in the early days a, a, a display suite is simply a box so you that's can true. really differentiate that by using beautiful furniture yep. Um, yep. and of course and then we can go on to packaging mm. um, furniture for developers yep. um, which just makes it easier for the client ongoing right. and so are there incentives for developers to bring in furniture like this into their projects? Yeah, I guess the um, one very simple incentive is it removes that constant question that the agent is asked, which is where, where does the furniture come from? Yeah. Um, and often if you've used an, an interior decorator or designer to furnish the display suite, they could have pieced it together from numerous suppliers mm -hmm. and the agent simply doesn't know where it's from. So this way it's all from Bow Concept. Yep. Um, I guess the developer has that opportunity to purchase the uh, furniture packages um, on, on a wholesale basis from us, which they can then resell to their uh, client. Yeah, that's yeah, right. Yeah, very yeah. good. And so what are some of the mistakes that uh, developers make when they're either engaging interior designers or picking furniture from a furniture store for yeah. themselves? Yeah. I think, at, kind of you just said it then, it really it is when, when a developer engages a designer or decorator to stage those suites or the yep. apartments we find that it's uh, what it often does is it pushes down a problem to the agent the right. agent doesn't want to constantly field uh, the questions as to where the furniture is from because the customers if you do it well are inspired by the furniture yep. um, if you don't get it from a single source um, then you're simply frustrating the agent and then the, mm. the customer. So creating consistency and a signified single image of how the project is going to look with everything that they need from the same brand. That's right. That's a yep. pretty easy way. Yeah. Very good. So Tim, with furniture and apartment sales, is there a way that developers can utilize this and remove the need for discounting? Yes. Look, if the developer is offering furniture packages, then what some developers will do is instead of offering a discount to close yep. the sale is they might offer the furniture package, which could be a $20,000, $50,000 package. Um, they're not paying that full amount for them. So it reduces the, the actual discount that they're giving, but also it just changes the, the whole tone of taking money off the table to adding extra value yeah, for the client. Yeah. And that's always a really positive thing mm. for everyone, absolutely. Yep. Look, that was all that we sort of wanted to cover in this video about how property developers can utilize uh, furniture staging in their projects. Next time around, we'll talk about project marketers and what they do with using Bow Concept. Thanks so much for watching.